Today I'm going to be looking at very briefly at the TYT or Titera MD9600. This is, um, well as far as I'm aware, is the first dual band uh, DMR radio um, or mobile radio. Um, it's 45 watts on UHF, uh, 50 watts on VHF and um, I've been busy programming this uh, this this radio up um, now for a, a little while um, and I think I've actually got got it uh, pretty much sorted um, it's it's fairly easy to operate um, if you press the enter there you can go scroll through the the contacts scan and zone lists and um, messages uh, call logs utilities and that's where you can set up some of the radio you can set the radio you know the, the different settings on the radio uh, get radio info um, and you can actually program uh, certain bits and pieces in into the radio um, if you go into radio settings you get like tones and alerts power levels bat lights and all that sort of stuff and if you press the band escape button it will just go back through the menu until you get to the to the front of the radio again at the moment we're listening to uh, vfo1 um, and we're in digital mode on that and if you press the band mode just once then it will scroll it will, it will go down to vfo2 and what i've done is on all of the um the zones i'm trying to put uh, maybe repeaters that are analog that might be nearby the the dmr repeater or something like that and on some of the um and hopefully we'll try and get all of the um the, the vhf um, analog and uhf analog frequencies as well alongside so at the moment i've got them set here so you can go through the various vhf channels and if we go back the other way i've programmed some up i'm right in the middle of doing this code plug and um, you can see on some of them what i've done is i've actually put the frequency followed by the uh, v number so you can actually see what which channel it is um, and again um, we've actually got the the talk group um, scrolling across and you know um, the name of the repeater or the the uh, talk group that you're on you can change that you know it's not hard and fast the the radio bit itself build quality is really really good very impressed with this um, the, the the audio from it is really good very good um, and all the reports I've had um, I've not said what radio I'm on um, all the reports I've had have been fairly good um, and you know with the, just the usual um, moans about sort of breaking up mobile and all that sort of stuff but uh, you know nothing nothing unusual in fact the majority of uh, the reports I've had have been actually very very positive so I'm actually thinking this is a reasonably good radio um, it's not a face-off radio which is a shame um, but it, it doesn't it's quite a small radio um, it's the same form factor as a Yaesu and you can see here I've got it on a Yaesu SMB201 base and it fits beautifully on that all the holes line up and everything so I'm, I'm quite impressed it's got a standard um, SO239 antenna port you've got a data port on the back there as well and um, an external speaker socket um, the only thing to note is that the programming cable is not a um, just a standard USB cable it is actually it does have some logic in the um, USB plug so you can't just use any old cable on that um, so but the, the cables aren't that expensive so they're, they're really easy the mic itself um, is pretty good um, you can do direct dial and you can you know do all the usual sort of stuff and you can actually program some of these buttons to do whatever you want in the software um, you've got uh, obviously a and b um, flick through the through the uh, uh, vfo with the with the microphone and you can go up and down through the channels with the microphone um, all in all um, that pretty much i'm going to leave it there really but um, 
all in all this 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 is a really 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 funky little radio i'm i'm very impressed with it um i've had it in the car i've had it in the shack and i've had absolutely no problems with it at all it doesn't run hot it doesn't do anything you know strange um so so far um i'm very pleased so uh, there you go time will tell Let, let's see anyway thanks for for watching and um hope to see you again soon